Good morning, boys and girls. How are you? Can't meet in 2021? I will go. Can't meet in 2021? I will go. Awesome. So before we have our children's story, we're going to pray. Remember, what do we say? Jesus? Jesus loves me. Very good. Our heads are bowed. Our eyes are closed. Dear Jesus, thank you so much for loving us. Thank you for dying on the cross for our sins. And now as we learn more about you, help us to be like you every day and prepare us for your soon coming. We pray all this in your mighty and precious name. Amen. Now, remember, we learned some songs during the week. Can we sing them together? Okay. cannot go into the world without the love of Christ. You cannot go into the world without the love of Christ. Can we sing one more song? Okay. Do you remember the actions? All right, let's go. I am yours, Lord. You are mine. I'm your cup, Lord. Pour out your love. I'm your candle, you make me shine. I am yours, Lord, you are mine. I am yours, Lord, you are mine. I'm your cup, Lord. Pour out your love I'm your candle You make me shine I am yours, Lord You are mine Elsa, remember when you go out You are the light of God And He's the one who's going to make you shine He's the one who makes you shine very good. Now, let's listen to this story. A long time ago, there was the saddest Sabbath ever. Everyone in heaven was sad. Everyone on earth in Jerusalem was sad. Do you know why? It was their first Sabbath without Jesus. Jesus was dead and he was in the tomb. So everyone was not happy. Even that day when they were doing Sabbath, people were not, they were not singing very happily because for the first time, Jesus was not there with them on the Sabbath. To make matters worse, do you know what they did? They sent people to guard Jesus' Jesus's tomb. So there were soldiers, and there were soldiers from the Roman army. There were soldiers also who were from the church. They were all standing, the big men with their muscles and their, and their swords, guarding the, the, the tomb of Jesus. And there was a seal to make sure the disciples do not steal Jesus from the tomb. Not only that, there were two other armies that the eye could not see. Other army was the army of demons. 
The devil was there. He didn't want Jesus to come out. So the devil and all the demons were there waiting. They wanted to stop Jesus from coming out. So they stood there waiting, waiting. Like, uh -huh. He will not come out. He will not come out. They waited. Friday, they waited. Saturday, they were waiting. And also, there was another army there. The army of holy angels. They could not be seen by the naked eye. The army from heaven was also there waiting for Jesus to resurrect. So when Jesus resurrects, they will see. But remember, everyone else was sad. In the church that day, they were sad. In heaven that day, they were also very sad. But guess what? The angels were waiting in heaven for, for Jesus to resurrect. There was one angel in particular. His name was Gabriel. His name was? Gabriel was waiting. He knew it was his job to go and wake Jesus up. So he, he waited. He was waiting. First on Saturday, he was sad. Saturday night, he was sad. But Sunday morning came. He looked at God. God, should I? Should I go? God said, wait. God, I want to go. I want to go and wake Jesus up. Wait. God, I want to go. Jesus said, all right, fine, fine. Three seconds. Three, two, one, and Gabriel went down from heaven, coming down to earth in super speed. <laughs> and he was so excited and so fast. By the time he hit the ground, there was an earthquake. The ground was shaking. The ground was shaking. And there was a big light. The light was so bright. The big soldiers looked at Jesus. They looked at the angel. They were shocked. Like, they were so shocked they fainted. The, the, the demons were also waiting. The devil and his demons were waiting for Jesus not to come out. Because of the light and the brightness of the angel coming from heaven, they also looked and they're like, ah, 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 here, we can't be here. They ran away. They, 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 the, the word I wanted to learn, they skedaddled. They, they skedaddled. They ran away. They disappeared. The angels of Jesus were waiting also. They were waiting. Gabriel came and hit the ground. There was a big earthquake. The big rock that was covering was the, the tomb of Jesus rolled away and Angel Gabriel walked into the tomb where Jesus was and said, Son of God, wake up. And do you know what happened? Jesus woke up with a new body and he walked out of his tomb with a new body. And guess what? 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 Very soon, when Jesus came out, it was just a reminder that very soon Jesus is going to come. But this time it won't be Gabriel alone. It will be Jesus and all the angels of heaven. The sky will fill all the angels. And not only that, Jesus will come with the angels. Guess what will happen to us who are here on earth when Jesus comes in the sky? We will pop to the sky. We will, we will pop. Are you ready to pop with me? Because you know what? Let me tell you what, happened. what, what will happen. When Jesus comes, the dead in Christ shall pop out of their graves. And not only the dead in Christ, and even us who are alive, when Jesus comes, we will be so excited, we will also, we'll also pop into the sky to spend forever and ever and ever with Jesus. Are you ready to pop with me? Are you ready to pop with me? One, two, and a half, and three quarters, Yes, we will pop out of our graves. And this time we will not come down like we keep coming down every time we try to pop here. We'll keep going and going and spend forever and ever with Jesus. And guess what? Let me tell you what, what Jesus says in Revelation chapter 22 verse 12. Jesus says, And behold, I am coming quickly, and my reward is with me to give everyone according to, the, according to his work. So, Jesus is coming to give you a reward. You a reward, you a reward, you a reward, and you a reward. Each and every one of us will receive a reward according to the work we've done. And what is the work we've been doing? We have been going, we have been, we have been going with the love of Christ to everyone we meet. So how many promise me that from today onwards, as we're waiting for Jesus to come, they will go? Can meet in 2021? I will go. Can meet in 2021? I will. Go. go. Yes, I will go with the love of Jesus. May Jesus give you the wisdom to go as we're waiting for him. 
get ready. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. We pop one last time. This time we'll pop and then we'll pray, okay? Jesus, when Jesus comes, the trumpet will sound. Pa, 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 pa. One, two, three, pop. We'll pop and spend forever with Jesus. Let's stand and we pray. We are praying. Our dear Heavenly Father, we are so grateful that you sent your son Jesus to die on the cross for our sins. And not only that, Lord God Almighty, that Jesus resurrected. And we know because he resurrected one day, we will also resurrect. We will see our loved ones resurrect from their graves. Not only that, but we will also pop up into the sky and spend forever with you. But King Jesus, until then, please help us. Fill us with your love. Help us to go into the world with your truth. Bless my little boys and girls this morning. We pray all this believing and trusting in your mighty name, King Jesus. Amen. God bless you. Amen.